Signing in and signing out. On desktop, click on Travelport Smart Point icon. Once you have clicked on the Galileo or Travel Point icon on the desktop, you will get this screen. Either you will be prompted for the login and password. If you are not prompted, you can use the command method also. To sign in Galileo, we use command SON followed by slash followed by your Galileo ID. You may have many terminals. I am currently using terminal T4. So I write the Galileo ID of tourism school, which is Z8E8X slash T4. I'm using T4 terminal and I click enter. So I will be prompted for the password. If I'm prompted for the password, I'll just straight away type on the password. The password currently is America 19 and I click on OK. So once I click on OK, I get this prompt. We can directly cancel this prompt and go ahead to work on the screen. In case you want to sign out of Galileo, we can use command SOF, which means that I want to sign off Galileo and my sign off is complete. Work areas in Galileo. To sign in Galileo, we first put our login and the password and we can sign in Galileo. Once we are signed in, we can start working. In Galileo, we have five work areas. The five work areas are mentioned on the top, which is A, B, C, D, and E. We can move to any other work area in case we want to work on multiple files together. So for example, I want to work on a booking file in work area A. I can open fares in work area B. I can look for availability in work area C and so on. These work areas are very good if you want to work on multiple files together without exiting the first booking file. So if I click on B, I will enter work area B and I would exit out of work area A. It's mentioned here. Either I can click on the work area alphabet or I can use the command method also. So if I do not click and if I want to use the command method, for example, if I want to work in the work area D, I do SD and I enter work area D and I exit out of work area C. Whatever work I am doing in work area C would remain. It's showing me that I am currently present in all the work areas and I have opened all the work areas. If I want to move back to work area A, I just type in SA and I move to work area A. So by just prefixing S with the work area, I can move to the other work area. So it means I can toggle between the work areas. And this is very, very useful if I want to work on multiple booking files together without exiting any of the files. Because if I work in one work area, I cannot work on multiple booking files together. And if I want to see which work area I'm currently working in, I type OP slash W star and this gives me the detail of the work areas and the work area I am currently working on. So it shows me that I am currently active on work area A. I'm working in work area B, C and D as well simultaneously and work area E is available. It means I am not currently working. If you see on the top, work area A, B, C, D have been highlighted with blue wrap and E has not been highlighted, which means that work area E is vacant and I am not working on this work area. How to access system help? To ignore any of the work in Galileo, I can just type I and my work will be ignored. So I click on I and my previous work will get ignored. The best part in the Galileo is that we can take the system help or we can see the Galileo information systems as well in Galileo. By using command gg star, a menu gets displayed which is the information index. Now I have multiple things which I can read. So in case I want to read paragraph number 7, the chapter number 7, so I can type gc star 7. So gc star followed by the chapter you want to read. 
So I do GC star seven, the complete chapter will get displayed in front of me. So here again, I have multiple paragraphs. So if I want to read, for example, the paragraph number three, so I do GP star three and paragraph number three will get displayed in front of me. And if I want to ignore my all the work, I click on I and my entire work goes. You can also take help from the Galileo system in case you are looking for certain kind of a help for example on meal codes. So I can type H slash meal codes and entire help for the world meal would be available. So here we go with the meal codes. In Suppose you want to take help of the system for, for example, the fair code command. So we type help FQ. So we can either use H star my query to display the help page or I can use help word followed by the command to get the help pages. Time to move to quiz or assignment.